quick mist, spun by a ghost after a violent death. Anna sure row number eight. Don't get lost in quick mist, lest the spectres get you. Wise, but I see no other way. Either Ben was lost in the mist, or he's the source of it. You might be able to drop down from here. I do love a drop into the deep unknown. Can't see further than the end of my arm down there. Don't worry, it'll affect your other senses too. Oh, this quick mist is way. That's, that's better. And a little terrifying. I could show you the way. Just saying. Something's here. Hidden. Do you see that? It looks like the fog is coming from those odd-looking stalagmites. Hold on. I think I can rid us of the quick mist. Oh. Well, I'm partly made of the same stuff. Find what caused it. You mean, let's find out who died. Mm, traces of a struggle. An echo hangs on it. Point passes an infinity of paths. I can't, I can't do it no more. On your feet, Lind. We don't no. give up. I've had enough. There's no way up. There's no way down. For days we've eaten nothing but boiled shoe leather. I'm done. We don't give up. <laughs> Leave me be. God be damned, I'm sick of carrying you. What are you doing? Don't hurt me. <laughs> I hate you. I hate you! Ben died in the fall. And now his maggoty ghost is back to haunt the friend who pushed him. So was Jacob lying to hide the murder? He wouldn't be the first. We need to find the body if the wolves haven't gotten there first.
Oh, a shite on a short stick. Bloody hell. The man's been torn to pieces. No, oh, wait. He's been carved with a knife. For his meat. Still no tie. A Jacob's hovel, perhaps? Jacob was eating meat. Jacob was eating Ben. Was he really hungry enough to eat his friend? Maybe the nightmare had something to do with it. Watch out. Spectre position. I think I 
used to count my wolf kills on one hand. I'm right here. Let's look for our tie while Jacob's outside. Who oh, there to you, Jacob? Mr. McCraith, sir? You were struggling yourself and Ben. Why'd you not leave? Leave? No, can't leave. This here is home. We trap here, we eat here, we tan pelt to leather here. Our lives are here. Can't leave. Did you not try the river? The fog had to lift some time, and if you stay, you'll starve. We have enough. Thanks to Ben. Ben wanted to leave. You argued. Remember? Ben's out and about right now. We don't argue, you know. One time, a storm caught us napping. Sidelong hailstones and everything. We was lost. But we found our way. Even then, Ben never said a word in anger. Even though I slowed him down. Has he lost his mind? Or is he tricking with us? I can't tell. Farewell to you, Mr. Lynn. Farewell, Mr. McCray, sir. Farewell. I think I found our tie. How did I not notice it before? There were so many spectral stains, it's a wonder we found it at all. Come on, let's talk to Ben. I should order the ghost to appear now. You're not Jacob. Who's you? My name is Red McCraith. The Scot. You? Antea Duarte. We're banishers. We can help you. Beyond help. Where's Jacob? You tried many times to leave this place. I tried and failed. Week on week, month on month, maybe. We went in circles. The woods are tricky, sir. Treacherous. Mean. Round and round we went. Round and round and back again. Jacob said you both had nightmares. The same nightmare. Aye. 
And yet we got no sleep. Couldn't tell truth from fantasy. The shadows seemed to flicker at the corners of our eyes. How long have you and Jacob been out here in the woods? Some winters now, but this one, it never ends. No way out, no way in. We were alone, not an animal in sight. No, when things changed, we got stuck. <laughs> These godforsaken woods. We know what befell you, Benedict. What keeps you here? He does. He waits and waits and waits on me. He'll not face what he has done, and I cannot go. I cannot go. But I'll not hate him. How could I? We thought he'd acted willfully, planned it. Tell the truth, we thought I'm a liar. No. Jacob is a kind and godly man. Pure and true, always. He's the very best of us. And yet, though I denied it, I saw it coming. I became wary. Some part of me knew what he was thinking. Because I was thinking it too. What do you want from Jacob? Do you seek revenge? I seek no vengeance. He is I, and I am him. Why do you not confront him? Why not show yourself? I did. He thought me alive. He showed me stake he'd scavenged. He was so proud. He offered me a share. He needs to face the truth. To accept what he has done to both of us. At night, he'd read scripture. God would mind us if we were good and honest. Jacob taught me that. We were good. We lived honest lives. We kept to ourselves, minded our business, and no one else's. So tell me, Banisher, what did we do to deserve this? This was not God's doing. Another powerful entity is at work here. New Eden is cursed. Then God has forsaken us, and we are doomed. Thank you, Benedict. Perhaps we'll talk again. Perhaps we shall, Banisher. Perhaps we shall. Jacob must confess. I fear the truth will break him. Oh, there to you, Jacob. Mr. McCraith, sir? I'm sorry, Jacob, we must talk. Something has happened to Benedict. What? Where is he? What happened? Come on now, Jacob. If something's happened to Ben, say so. Where is he? Day after day, you woke hungry from your nightmares. 
You tried to escape and failed many times until you broke. You killed your friend, Jacob. What? No. No, that's not what happened. Leave me be. Aye. That's what you said to Benedict before you pushed him off the cliff. But that's not all, is it? You killed Benedict, then you ate him. You were starving to death, yes, but you made your choice. You're not real. You're not real. You're a monster. If there's a monster here, Jacob, it's you. Speak. Cast off your guilt. Then we'll see what can be done about the shame. I failed him. I failed Benedict. I was so angry, so angry. He kept pushing me. We kept, we argued, and I couldn't think. When I saw him lying there, on the ground, lifeless, the whisper said, it was him or me, him or me. I would have died. I should have died. For my sins, I deserve no better. I fail God. I failed my friend. I'm a monster. I deserve no mercy. No. You're just a sinner, begging for help. We both faced a choice, simple and awful, to kill or to die. You struck first, and here we are. Do you forgive me? Our fates are in the hands of others now. Yes. Banisher, do your job. If you're to come back, if we're to use the ritual we spoke of, this is when it starts. Red, if we take one step along that path... Jacob is ready to die. The others won't be. We'll tell lies. We'll harvest the essence of the living. I'll shoulder the blame. As the man says, we face a choice, simple and awful. Do we kill? To be together again? Or do we part forever? We must decide now.
Benedict Stoughton. You were betrayed, failed and defiled. You were bound to a world to which you no longer belong. You have no reason to stay. You are not welcomed, neither do you wish to be here. I did not want this. It was him or me. A curse on Jacob for what he did. Curse this damn fog too. Curse this forest. Curse it all. It's over, Jacob. Ben's gone for good. Thank you. I... Thank you. It's over. The tie will sustain me a little longer. Jacob, would you mind if I rest inside a while? Suit yourself. No more maggots. Ben is gone for good. killed and ate his friend. When I was a soldier, I heard many stories of those besieged eating their own. Some were true. Famine is a ferocious master. Jacob was hungry. Just yeah, like you. Just like me. How do you feel? I feel trapped, locked into an embrace with a nightmare. I crave, I crave essence. With it, I'd not so fast decay. With it, I'd not so quickly become one of those stupid bloody specters. We made the right choice. We made it together. Taking a life is no small matter. When I ascend, we'll be separated. For the rest of your life. Maybe for the rest of eternity. Never again shall we stand side by side. This we 
This thing we have shall cease to be. That's settled. Thank you. I hope you've no regrets. Soon I'll reclaim my life. We will pay the highest of prices. We banishers may call it blaming, but our hearts will know we're taking lives. How many? I don't know. Perhaps too many to ask of you. I want us back, Red. I want revenge on what killed me. I want to live. I want it too. With the whole of my heart. No price too high. I will do it. By my oath, I swear it, my love. I'll see you back from the dead. <laughs> 